Hello Pisces, welcome to your abundance reading for June 2021. Let's get started. First card you've got out is transformation. And it says, things are changing at a cellular level, deep healing. I'm being told to pull the other card at the same time. And it's align your life. And this card says, what is not, what is not aligned or needs to change? Okay, so what I'm picking up from these two energies here is that you are definitely going through a period of big changes. Uh, they're telling me that these changes are ones that are going to affect you in all areas of your life. There's going to be a need to rearrange um, and, yeah, rearrange your, your finances, maybe your living situation. They're saying over the next six months, um, they're saying this change is is a slow burner it's something that is going to evolve over time but they're saying they're showing me the chariot so they're saying that it's something that is underway it's getting started for some of you it is something that has already begun um so you are aware of or you can sense whatever this change is for some of you then that's for most of you but they are saying some of you uh okay you're on the precipice of it but Okay, they're saying that you are entering into a, a new timeline or a, a new reality of, of some sort. It's, okay, they're saying that there's been a lot of healing um, and uh, working on yourself over the last year or so. Uh, they're also saying maybe six months for some of you. And as a result, um, you have been manifesting shifts and changes in your life. New, new people may be coming in, old people may be leaving, um, opportunities can arise. But they're really, they're really indicating to me sort of like a, a, a rearrangement of things in your life. So it's not necessarily that you, you have to give up things. Um, okay, they're, okay, they're saying even if you do end up having to let go of certain things, what comes into your experience is going to be even better. So yeah, they're showing me the Nine of Cups, so it's sort of like wishes coming true in that respect. Um, but reorganizing and rearranging your life and, and different areas of your life. So it's, yeah, okay, thank you. They're talking about doing things in a different way, um, to, to do things in a different way, to look at things from a different perspective. They're showing me Ace of Swords. Now, so they're also talking about uh, having a clearer perception and, and more clarity, clear view, clear foresight, um, and, um, and, and creating a clear path for yourself. Uh, I'm just trying to tune in to like what specific changes they're indicating, but they're really just saying it's across the board, it's gonna be different for different people, but they're saying that the Pisces Collective is, is definitely in a space where they can feel that even if they don't yet know in what way it's going to manifest, um, but th there's just this sort of sense like, oh, things are changing, I can feel that things are changing. Um, and this card, Align Your Life, that's where they're talking about this uh, rearranging thing. So let's see the other cards you've got. You've got the Leap card. And it says, you go first, the universe will catch you. Okay, so they're talking about um, having faith. They're talking about um, sort of taking a chance in a sense where you are following your instincts, you're following your feelings, and of course, make sure you stay safe and all these kinds of things, use your common sense. But they are talking about um, uh, sensing energy and sensing the shifts in your reality. Okay, thank you. So, sort of like this idea, you don't need to see it in order to believe it. You believe it and then you see it. Um, Okay, they're talking about, okay, energetically uh, moving forward into this new life that you are wanting to create. So they're also talking now about this idea of doing a lot of visualizations and meditations because they're talking about, okay, they're saying that there are things that you can do to push the energy forward. The, the stream is moving, the energy is moving, but as you build momentum, things can go forward. And again, I'm, I'm just really seeing it sort of like... Um, it, it's not like a specific thing comes into your life only. It's, it's a huge overhaul of change in your life. So everything about your life and what you know is, um, is going through or is about to go through a big change. And look at the, the last card you've got here. It's the ever unfolding rose. 
and it says cracked open it's happening for you not to you so all of these cards here so interesting are indicative of change and that's what i've been getting for a lot of the signs for the abundance reading but for the pisces collective it's it's um much more intense it's a very big expansive change um so i'm just trying to tune in let's see if we can get another let me see can we get thank you Okay, boundaries is the card that you got. Okay, so because I wanted to ask about, um, can I get any information about what kinds of changes the Pisces Collective can expect? And um, what I just heard as I uh, touched this card, they, they actually said relationships. So something about the, your relationships with people is, um, the, is sort of going to ignite change in your life. Uh, they're saying maybe an opportunity to uh, network or work with a, a group of people. Uh, some of you may be getting offered to work abroad or or work in a um, work in a new field, something like this. But uh, okay, let me just tune in. You need to establish better boundaries. Okay, so they're also talking about past energy as well. As a result of you working on your relationships in the recent past, being able to have better boundaries with people. Okay, thank you. Being able to speak your truth is something that you have been working on, something that you've learned. And okay, Spirit wants to applaud you for that. They're saying you're, you're being much more honest and truthful about who you are and, and what you want in your relationships and what you want out of your life as well, what you want to create for yourself. And they're saying that that is, that is a big thing for the a lot of Pisces out there that has been the catalyst for change, whereby standing in your own truth, you, you're now able to... Uh, broaden broaden your energy out and call in all of the different things that um, you you've been uh, creating you know even even um, unconsciously so uh, they're just kind of showing me sort of like all these different light bubbles sort of coming in to your experience and I really can't pinpoint it because it's all different kinds of things I mean it's relationships it's it's finances um, it's health they're also saying health um, they're also talking about getting into some sort of creative endeavor as well. Um, they're talking about healing. So maybe some of you are wanting to move into some sort of healing business, um, moving more into embracing your spirituality is what I'm hearing as well. Um, being called to step up into purpose. Um, they're showing, okay, they're saying Arizona for some reason. Maybe that's significant to someone here. Um, they're talking about um, joining forces joining forces okay that's what i'm hearing uh they're showing me sort of like um yeah like being somewhere in nature i keep getting arizona for some reason and um go going on some sort of mission so that's obviously a specific message there all right pisces that's what i got for you i hope it helps please like share comment and subscribe if you resonate with this work all additional information will be down below in the description box thank you so much take care and i'll speak to you soon Bye bye